Don't get offended. Don't fuck with me. Don't fuck with me is not just a catchy candle and a catchy phrase. This candle, don't fuck with me, is a movement that has started in Paris. It's about a project that I am financing to support the Don't Fuck With Me brand, which is about women who have gone through an entire journey of all their internal external hardships and have come out the other side who now want to support others who are going through that journey, be it cancer, be it disease, be it uh, eating disorders, be it self-doubt, be it gender identification, be it rape, be it uh, office um, harassment, sexual harassment, you name it, these women have gone through it. I'm going to put the link in the bio for Don't Fuck With Me. Go read their stories. It is very moving. Very, very moving. Don't Fuck With Me is also about that little moment where the person who has gone through this and have come out the other side has done that one last extra step to say, I am going to extend help to the next person who's going through this. And that, by the way, is a very human um, character, which is a very nice character to say, don't, I'm done, I'm don't fuck with, look at the posture, right? When somebody says, don't fuck with me, their posture stands different. They're powerful. They're, they're like, their hand goes out like this, stop, don't fuck with me. But they, the person who's going through it hasn't experienced that yet. And that's what this is about. Look, I've been through my cancer as well, so I said it. But I looked, I'm out. I'm, I'm done with my cancer. But what did I do when I was in it? I looked for friends, family, people, or everyone who has been there for me are the people who gave that last bit of the don't fuck with me, little help. That's really what this is all about. Plus, the Don't Fuck With Me brand is supporting uh, by donating 10% of the proceeds to the Sexual, Alli uh, Sexual Alliance, uh, Alliance of Sexual Abuse in New York City. Sorry. And I'll put that link as well to where the support is going through. Is it catchy? For some people, this is going to be a very catchy Don't Fuck With Me. It's going to be cute. But there's a real, real story behind it. Read it. Look at it. It's a collaboration between me, Maison 10, and don't fuck me the brand in Paris. You can buy, you can go and visit the store on 29th Street on the second floor Maison 10. The guys are fantastic there. You can buy it if you're in the city, buy it there. Or you can buy it through our website, my website uh, on Thompson Ferrier. You look at collaborations. But the big point is, it sounds like it's a catchy phrase, but it's a super, super, super empowering, um, posturing, of the world, of you against the world to say, I am done, I am out, I have had it, I know where I stand, I am ready to help someone else who is going to need this feeling to get to the other side, going through the forest, going through the journey, going through what you're going through. That, by the way, is what this is all about. If you want to think it's catchy, fantastic. If you want to think it's uh, beautiful, the story, fantastic. You want to be part of it, fantastic. But read their stories. You will have tears.